the only thing you can offer as an individual is a story that you believe in, that you're passionate about. The real way to be a storyteller is to tell a story that only you can tell. That, that's the secret of independent film, is tell your own story. The first and foremost thing that I do is storytelling. I really believe that in the core of all myths and in the core of all stories, there's this hero's journey, which there's always a character that's the character, your protagonist that you're gonna follow, and they go through very, very predictable um, moves, movements as the story progresses, and you can see that through all movies um, and all storytelling. I imagine every film you do is personal to a certain extent, because to make the emotions real, you have to feel them and experience them. So that's how you put a personal feeling into, into the film. I, I think inspiration always comes from, it's usually an idea. It could, be, it could be an image, it could be an idea, it could be a story, it could be a character, but it's gotta be something that really drives you. Filmmaking in Mexico is incredible right now. I get a lot of inspiration from the filmmakers out of Mexico City and out of the whole country. When you're in production, there's only a limited amount of time and a limited amount of creativity and a limited amount of money. Often you find things not going the way you imagine them. The best things happen when you sort of getting into the flow of what's happening and making the best result out of the experience that's in front of you. There's a, there's a moment between action and cut which is the greatest moment, and the reason why I think most filmmakers work is because between action and cut, the entire crew is completely focused on what's happening in front of the lens. It's the director's job, I believe, to understand what the movie is about. And that's why you often think about a theme. If you know what your story is about, then when you go to each scene in the movie, you'll know what that scene, how that scene is describing that theme. And then if you know how the scene is describing that theme, when you go to set up a shot, you'll know where to put the camera. Because there really is only one place where the camera is supposed to go to tell a story. So that's your job as a director.